Today's article is titled Three Types of Marriages That Can't Survive the Seven Year Age. Recently, I visited a family friendly restaurant with my child. At the next table sat a family of three. The dad was glued to his phone, while the mom interacted with their child. After eating, the child went off to play, leaving the parents alone and awkwardly silent. Eventually, the wife also pulled out her phone, occasionally glancing at her child. Compared to the cheerful atmosphere around, this couple seemed out of place. The wife sighed, got up to find their child, while the husband stayed on his phone. When they went to pay, the cashier mentioned a 50% discount if couple shared a kiss and posted it online. The wife seemed interested, but the husband refused, saying he'd rather pay full price than be embarrassed. As they left, he walked ahead, and she trailed behind with her child, still not speaking. Watching this, I felt sad. It reminded me of a scene, a woman living happily before marriage, but after burdened with chores, kids, and stress from in-laws. Many marriages shift from constant conversation to silence. After marriage, women often face husband's indifference, in-laws neglect, body changes, and work stress all alone. If husbands don't offer support, a gap forms, leading to the three-year age. That often turns into the seven-year age if not managed. Beyond indifference, marriages where values clash can be exhausting. My friend's classmate, Lisa, discovered this during her honeymoon. Lisa wanted a private trip with her husband, but he insisted on bringing his mom, accusing her of being selfish when she disagreed. They ended up sharing a hotel room with his mother to save money, leaving Lisa upset. Later, he even threw her dog out of a window during an argument, saying it was for her health. Heartbroken, she left, and he didn't even apologize. This is a true clash in values, where one's way of life feels incompatible with the others. Another common issue today is absent partner marriages. These often happen when a husband only works and ignores family responsibilities, assuming that's enough. However, while he just focuses on work, his wife manages kids, household chores, and elderly care all alone. How could that not lead to exhaustion? Some women realize they'd rather be on their own than stay in a marriage, where they're both mother and father to their children. Without change, even if such marriages survive three years, they rarely make it to seven. Lasting marriages require mutual effort and shared responsibilities. Husbands must also contribute at home and spend time with kids. Relationships thrive when both partners adjust, support each other, and grow together.